guys welcome back to my channel as you guys see by the title i wanted to get dupe for you guys for the charlotte tilbury powder girl went all over the place trying to find a dupe for you guys and i think i found it so this is the charlotte tilbury powder here i rave about this airbrush flawless finish skin perfecting micro powder for months i've been using it holy grail love it you see it look like a spaceship from the inside and this is what it looks like here okay so this is the shade deep okay this is the dupe that i found this is number seven uh, and this is lit and luminate triple action and this is a translucent finish powder three age defining results so it reduces the appearance of fine lines even skin tone and visible smooth for skin so i got this from walgreens okay this is very hard to find you could ship it to your house okay so this is what i did and i, I think you could ship it at the store so the charlotte tilbury powder is 45 dollars, and this is 12 dollars. i think they only have maybe like three shades three i think it's three shades this is a this is the deep one and the charlotte tilbury one is also deep okay but let's just see what this one looks like because you guys know what the charlotte tilbury powder looks like anyway so it comes in this little thing and this is actually new okay when i saw this i'm like oh my god this looks exactly like the charlotte tilbury powder it looks like a spaceship <laughs> that's what i call it it's a little bit more bulky than the charlotte tilbury powder if you guys could see it as you guys can see it has number seven here it's just like a little glass you can see yourself it's a little bit more smaller inside but it looks the same it's just a little bit more bulky than the charlotte tilbury powder like this one here number seven is 10 ounce so you get more in this as you guys can see it comes with a mirror as well and this is the deep shade like if i bring it close to the camera it's probably gonna look a little bit more washed out so i'm gonna bring it back and let's just see what the charlotte tilbury powder looks like it probably look a little bit more lighter yeah it's a little bit more lighter but i don't know how this powder is gonna work on the skin but you guys know i use the charlotte tilbury powder for everything Set under the eyes, all over the face. Same, we're gonna do the same thing as this one. So on number seven packaging, it says your better looking skin in instantly smoother and more radiance. The multitasking powder seamlessly sets makeup uh, while delivering three age defining results, okay? It reduces the appearance of fine lines, like I said, even skin tone and visible smooth to skin. Uh, this powder doesn't cake or sell it into fine lines throughout the day and feels soft and silky delivers a radiant finish okay so the only thing i have on my face is this primer this is from range beauty okay and then i just spray my face with some of this setting um setting spray okay okay so for this step i'm going to be using the eat cosmetics your skin but better foundation and you guys know i love this foundation so this is like my second time using this foundation So let's just see how this one swatch on my hand now my hand is a little bit more darker than my face let's just see so this is the shade here and Charlotte Tilbury I'll put it on the other side I'm not saying that they are the same but it's just a dupe and I think that the Charlotte Tilbury powder is a little bit on the lighter side you guys can see but when you put it on your skin you really don't see the light stuff that's one of the reasons and it just melt into the skin really really nice Okay, so I'm gonna be using two brushes, one on each side, and then this brush is like really cheap. So this is the Shiny brush, and this is the Buff Bronzing brush. But I use this for all of the face, and this is F17 brush. Um, Sonia Cash is very popular. You get them on Target. Usually carry their brand. Okay, so I'm gonna do one side with Charlotte Tilbury, and the other side with Number Seven. Now I'm not saying that they are the same. You know they are duped. So we just wanna see how they work together. Okay, so I'm gonna use this one first because. I'm really skeptical to see how this one, you know, works on my skin. It does pick up a good bit amount with the brush. Charlotte Tilbury one, don't do that. And so let's just see how it set everything. And you guys know I like to start <laughs> down here first, just in case like something happened and I have to wipe it off. That's just how I do it. And I'm gonna go down on my neck because I didn't put any foundation there. And this is what I do and you know you just want to make sure that it blend out really nice so just in case that you decide to go out 
and you you know you just want to make sure that it blends out good because you never know girl so this powder is like really nice actually we could see a difference you okay? see how much it picks up on the brush you could see a difference it's actually it looks like a full coverage powder So you guys see the side here look how beautiful this powder is most times when i use powders you know i use it to cover up what the foundation couldn't cover up so this is giving me actual nice natural finish and i'm putting a little bit more i really do like the coverage you guys see and this is just without anything so i'm going to be using the charlotte tilbury on this side and you guys know that it's a little bit on the light side but one thing i like about the charlotte tilbury powder is there's no kickbacks okay and i'm gonna start up in the bottom so you guys can see what i'm talking about like it actually melts into the skin so you don't see that white stuff after but you guys see the difference this one has a little bit more color okay And I'm just gonna bring that down here. So the number seven has more color than the Charlotte Tilbury because the Charlotte Tilbury one is a little bit more on the light side. I get more coverage with number seven this is number seven and I could see that there is something there. I could tell because you know, I'm doing a comparison, but I still do like this powder. Now I really love number seven because, and I get more color on this side. Now with this side is beautiful. I love it. It does the same thing. It blurs imperfection. So this is what everything looks like. And I just want to come up close so you guys can see. So this is what it looks like with the Charlotte Tilbury side. It's a little bit more wire, so, but it also blends into the skin after a few hours. So you really don't see this. Now with this side, I get a little bit more color. This is actually my shade, like perfect. Okay. I don't even think they have a darker shade to this, but this, it really don't even matter because it just blends into the skin. And when it sits into the skin, you really can't tell, right? So I like both of them. This is definitely a dupe for the Charlotte Tilbury powder. And I just want to show you guys what it looks like when everything is settled into the skin. So this is the side of Charlotte Tilbury powder, okay? And this is the side of the dupe powder. You can't really tell I have two different powders on my face. They basically does the same thing. One is just a little lighter than the other one. And you don't want to spend that $45. I recommend that you guys get this powder because it's like the same thing as you guys can see. So I want to come up close so you guys can see it. And this is Charlotte Tilbury. Okay. I don't have any fine lines, so I can't even tell you guys it reduces the fine lines. Okay. Uh, the another one here is even skin tone. It does. It even skin tone. I'm keep on looking at this side, but it's this side I want to say. It even skin tone really good. Uh, at first, it came off a little bit more darker than the Charlotte Tilbury, but the Charlotte Tilbury um, powder, when it melts into the skin, it's like the same thing. You can't really tell. Now, if you guys really look at this powder, it's a little bit on the darker side than the Charlotte Tilbury one, but this looks so nice on my skin. I can't even, I can't even like, so let me know what you guys think. I recommend that you pick this up. If you already have the Charlotte Tilbury powder, it is what it is. But if you don't have it and you're looking for a dupe, this is it right here, girl. Um, I hope this video helped you guys. Please let me know in the comments below what you guys think about both powders, especially number seven. So thank you guys so much. See you guys in my next video. Bye.